What is going on guys? Welcome back to the vlog. Today we have the new sled reveal. Uh, it's my girlfriend sled Gianna. That's Gianna. Say hi. Hi. That's Gianna. <laughs> You'll be seeing more of her, but today we got 8,000 subscribers and we picked up the new sled today. So the sled reveal video today, that's what you guys are getting. I told you guys to guess in the comments like what sled I'm getting, what's going to be my second sled. And a lot of you guys said XCR and a lot of you guys said Switchback Assault. Um, I'll tell you guys one of those is correct. And yeah, you're about to find out. Ready to show them? Yeah. Let's go. All right. It is a Switchback Assault. 2011 Switchback Assault 800 144 with the one and three inch track. It has 7,800 miles and it's actually a rebuilt motor. So it has less than that. I believe it has only 2,500 miles on the motor. So that's pretty sweet. By the way, for this sled, 2011 7,800 miles rebuilt motor, I paid $3,400, which I think is a steal. Comment down below and let me know if you think that was a good deal or if I overpaid or shouldn't have bought it. It's a rebuilt motor, high miles, whatever. But I think it's a steal. The guy before me that had this sled took really great care of it. He um, like was an honest dude, straight up. He knew everything about the sled. He was only selling it because he was getting a 2019 Switchback Assault 800. Um, so we're gonna go over everything like he replaced or did to the sled. Recently replaced all the bogey wheels on the sled. New Hyfax has rebuilt shocks. Obviously a rebuilt motor with about 2,500 miles on it. Put the red skid plate on. He put the gripper skis on instead of the ones that the Assault comes with, which is pretty sweet. It doesn't have a windshield right now, but it did come with a windshield bag. Came with this tunnel bag. It doesn't have the mountain grab bar here. Uh, it got taken off for some reason, so we're gonna order another one of those. And it came with handguards, a pair of white handguards, black, and it came with red. I'm not too sure what color we're gonna go with, but we're definitely gonna put some handguards on it. And inside my truck we have, he gave me a canvas, like the nice Polaris canvas cover, which is pretty sweet. And I have three spare belts, so that's pretty cool too. So we're gonna fire this thing up for you guys, let you guys hear it. It's stock, but we'll still start it anyways and uh, run it for you guys. John's trying to start it, do it. <laughs> Come on. You just gotta get it back to that initial. Yeah, you got this. Ah, uh, she gave up. <laughs> All right, so the plans for this sled, basically, I'm not sure that we're gonna wrap it yet. We haven't decided. Depends on like what color gear Gianna gets and whatnot. But we're gonna take off all these stickers, like these Amsoil stickers. Um, keep calm and chive on. Yeah, that's gonna come off. We're gonna take off this, uh, I don't know, some school sticker, I guess. We'll take that off. Take off this um, other school sticker. Don't know what that is either, but that's coming off. Um, this will come off, this will come off. Probably take that GoPro mount off, because I don't need it. She doesn't really need it either. So we'll probably take that off. We need to get a windshield for this. I, I don't know, I think she should do good with the tall windshield because it keep her warmer and like keep her chest warm. I want the low windshield because I like to look at the low, but I don't know, or maybe we'll just go back with the mid that this came with. So we gotta decide on a windshield yet. We're probably gonna keep the skis red, keep the red skid plate. I do wanna put an exhaust on it. Um, exhaust? Yeah. Yeah, we're doing exhaust. So mm -hmm. we're probably gonna put an exhaust on it. I don't know, it's probably gonna be a trail can though, not a mountain because Brandon has the mountain can on his, and it's it's too loud. You don't you don't need the mountain. So look inside the motor on the exhaust side. You see here's the stock can. We want to get rid of that. Uh, lighten it up. Give it a little tone. Everything in here looks clean, good, ready to go, well maintained. I'm gonna change the spark plugs out and probably siphon out the gas that's in there, just to be sure and just for preventive maintenance to make sure nothing happens to it. But other than that, everything looks immaculate in here. Then here's your clutch side, the oil, spare belt. It's got all the tools in the toolkit. And like I said, I mean, yeah, the oil container's a little dirty. I could just wipe that up with some degreaser. Clutches look good, everything checks out there. So Gianna came up with a name for her assault. What's uh, what's her name? It's gonna be Alyssa Assault. Explain. Um, I mean, Assault has two S's, so Alyssa has two S's, so I thought it was cute. So this is Alyssa Assault. You'll be seeing a lot of Alyssa and Gianna this winter. So now we got the 850 RMK in the family 800 switchback assault we have my dad's 850 sks my mom's 600 players dragon switchback and my sister's 600 players dragon switchback so we have a whole fleet this year so it's super fun to make all these videos with all these sleds um i can't wait to ride this i'm really excited to ride this honestly probably more excited to ride this than to ride this because i already know what that's like i have never ridden this so i'm super excited and i've always wanted one of these perfect sled for g Brandon has the 600 with the two inch. I wish this sled had the two inch, but um, it's hard to find one for a good price and with a two inch, so we settled with the one and three eighths. At least it's an 800 instead of brand six. <laughs> Upcoming video on the Assault this week will probably most likely be taking the stickers off, cleaning it, polishing the tunnel, the plastics, getting it looking mint. I also siphon out the fuel, 
and then like clean the engine a little bit around the oil because you can tell like he missed and it spilled a little bit and then also change the spark plugs just do all the preventive like preseason stuff just to make sure it's good to go so, so yeah be on the lookout for videos on the sled like i said we're back in season like i'm doing three videos a week i'm sticking to it um my girlfriend and Brandon are gonna like push me to do that because I know I get lazy with filming. So they're gonna push me to do three videos a week. In December, we're going to the Upper Peninsula of Michigan, December 27th through January 1st. And she's coming with, she'll be riding Alyssa. I'll be riding the 850. Are you coming or no? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe, he might, Brandon might be coming. But um, yeah, we're gonna be up there December 27th. My um, first time riding. Her first time riding and she's riding an 800 Switchback Assault, so that's pretty fun. We got her a bunch of new gear. Um, Maybe we'll film a video on that one day. Yeah. Once we get all of her gear, we'll make a video on just her gear and talk about like what we got her. We went to the Milwaukee show and got her stuff, so once we have everything, we'll talk about that. But um, we'll have a Teaching My Girlfriend to Ride video. That'll be a lot of fun. <laughs> so that's going to wrap up today's video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are as excited about the assault as I am, and I know John's very excited too. So I hope everyone's excited for it. I'm excited for what's happening at 50. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace out. First things first, I'm a killer, ice lemon chiller, pour another drink, let it fill up, ice cream paint, let my curt go bangs, I just made my own wave, I don't need your lane, why my shit go, bang, bang, why my shit go.